guys, it's Stark. And I'm Caden. And welcome back to your daily video announcements. Today for lunch we have pancake sandwich, tater tots, yogurt cup, juice blend, goldfish grams, orange, and a cold milk. Let's take a look at today's holidays. Now, let's take a brief look at your sports and activities week at a glance. Next, let's take a quick glance at your top five news stories of the day. Here are today's top five news stories. Number one, prop firearm goes off in new movie set and kills staff member. Number two, White House once again delays the release of secret JFK assassination records. Number three, Atlanta Braves and Houston Astros make World Series. Number four, Las Vegas auction sells Picasso paintings for over a hundred million. For over a hundred million. Number five, Kellogg's faces five million dollar lawsuit for not having enough strawberries in his pop tarts. Next, thank you for two hundred fifty thousand views on Hornet Studios channel. Really, thank you. It's a milestone for us. Now let's play Guess Who. My name's Ellie. Um, I'm Josie. That's Rapunzel. Rapunzel from Tangled. Clifford, Clifford. from Big Red Dog. Snow White. <laughs> oh. <gasps> That's that hot guy from All American. <laughs> Winnie the Pooh. Winnie the Pooh. James. For an announcement on Red Ribbon Week. Red Ribbon Spirit Week. Tuesday will be Dress as Your Favorite Career. Wednesday will be Dress Hawaiian. Thursday will be Wear Pajamas. Friday will be Wear Your Favorite Costume. Let's head on over to weather. Today's high will be 75 with a low of 57 and a 77% chance of rain. Now for a quick blast of the past, let's wrap up with this day in history. Stay classy, UVC. October 26, 2001. In Washington, President George W. Bush signs the USA Patriot Act more than a month after the September 11th attacks. The act gives federal authorities unprecedented ability to search, seize, detain, or eavesdrop in their pursuit of possible terrorists. It will help law enforcement to identify, to dismantle, to disrupt, and to punish terrorists before they strike. 1972. American and North Vietnamese negotiators reach a ceasefire agreement. Henry Kissinger, President Richard Nixon's national security advisor, declares, We believe that peace is at hand. But the agreement soon collapses after South Vietnam objects. Months later, a new agreement is signed, ending America's military role in the Vietnam War. 1881. The gunfight at the O.K. Corral takes place in Tombstone, Arizona. That's where Wyatt Earp, his two brothers, and Doc Holliday confront Ike Clanton's gang. Three members of Clanton's gang are killed, while Earp's brothers are wounded. 1942. You're not crucifying people outside a church on Good Friday. Bob Hoskins, the character actor whose roles include Who Framed Roger Rabbit, The Long Good Friday, and Mona Lisa, is born in Britain. In 1946. Pat Sajak, longtime host of the game show Wheel of Fortune, is born in Chicago. Day in History, October 26th, Carlotta Bradley, The Associated Press. 